Every year, Save the River's Friend of the River Awards are given to people in the river communities who through years of service and dedication have made positive contributions to the river and its environment. Susan Weston Smith, known as Susie, is the author of The First Summer People, Thousand Islands, 1650 through 1910, and editor of the online magazine, Thousand Islands Life. The magazine was created by Paul Mallow, a professor of architecture at Syracuse University and author of three books about the Thousand Islands. When Paul died in 2008, Ian Korstein, photographer and Paul's dear friend, asked Susie if she would take over. At first she said no, but with her love of history and love of the river and its history, she accepted in September 2008. A new website was created in December of that year, allowing the site to take off. Susie and her 300 plus authors and volunteer authors and photographers are all volunteers. Susie is adamant that the purpose of TI Life is to build pride and discovery on both sides of the river. She often says, sharing the history of the special region is our goal. And we put an equal emphasis on having those in Canada say, what's going on over there? Pointing to the U.S. and those in the U.S. saying, what's happening over there in Canada? After all, there really is very little distinction between the two countries along the river. Susie has also used her powerful TI Life online magazine to educate people about the river environment and ecosystem, helping to protect our precious fish and birds. Susie and her husband, Marcelli Ween, spent part of the winter in Ottawa and moved back to their Canadian island near Gananoqua as soon as the ice goes out in the spring. They stay until the beginning of November. Working in the volunteer world is one of Susie's passions. She served on the board of Save the River as president of TILT and is currently on Gananoqua's Arthur Child Heritage Museum's board. Susie was the president of the Zana Club of Ottawa from 2006 through 2012. Zana's mission is to improve the status of women worldwide. It's part of Zana International in 67 countries with over 30,000 members. Susie spent a professional career as a fundraiser, raising major gifts at McGill and Queen's University and the Faculty of Medicine at the University of Ottawa. Susie is asked to be a guest speaker several times a year. She says she enjoys speaking to groups as she has the opportunity to talk about the history she loves and to meet river families who always have a story to tell. The list of her speaking engagements and publications is too lengthy to list today. They will be on our website in the near future. Congratulations to Susie Smith for being a recipient of Save the Rivers 2021 Friend of the River Award. I would like to thank Susie's daughter, Janet Smith Staples, for her help in furnishing many of my comments about Susie. 